It was 1919 when this building basically began to service a transmission line from Winnipeg to Portes La Prairie. And what it meant is that the people in Portes La Prairie were now powered by the Winnipeg River. Records shows it fed Portage La Prairie in uh, 1919. And since then there was 12 kV distribution here and there's 4 kV distribution here that was installed in the 50s, which is still in service today. You know, some of the equipment we incorporated into the new Stafford station across the street about 10 years ago and the remaining 4 kV distribution is still in service here and there's no immediate uh, plan in place to, to change it out. It was built to last, like we, we do regular maintenance checks, we ensure that the roof is intact and there's no shifting, it's a, it's a solid building. It'll be here for years to come. This building is not very well known. People have probably driven by it numerous times without giving it a second thought. And it seems to me that if you are a little more aware of the surroundings, it, you know, it gives you a better appreciation for how, how lucky we are today.